Hello gamers, I wanted to take a second before this episode starts to actually make a correction. I spend a relatively large amount of time during this episode talking about the fact that I don't own this game, Mixed Up Mother Goose, and uh, after the episode I got to think that's actually not true. Um, this is a picture of my uh, Sierra collection, as it were, at least the ones that I have physical copies of. Um, I talked about I have most of my stuff digitally on GOG or on um, on Steam. I don't actually even have a CD-ROM player, let alone a, a floppy disk player. Uh, although I will probably order a DVD, CD-ROM, USB drive off of uh, Amazon. Uh, maybe even a, a floppy disk drive, too, because as you can see in the picture here, uh, there is uh, Hoyle Classic Games on disc, and that's actually interesting to me. But... In the middle of the bottom there is Roberta Williams Anthology, and I really, I think of the fact that I have that sometimes and other times I don't, but um, I didn't think, I usually think of it just as like a bunch of King's Quest games, and I think maybe the Laura Bow 1 and 2, but in reality, it it does have that, but it also has Mixed Up Mother Goose. Not that that means anything, because I, again, don't have a CD-ROM drive right now, so I couldn't have loaded it, although I could have booted up an old computer and done it. And I do not have Manhunter, which I talk about uh, in the in the video, wanting to test whether or not uh, you can play through the web, the playability of things through the web, and Mixed Up Mother Goose was a good test for that. So it doesn't really change the fact uh, of of me playing it through the web browser. So I didn't want to re-record it or anything. But yeah, um, I just uh, I did want to make that correction that I do actually own this game, uh, and I uh, I have a picture of the old Forester nineteen ten that I drink during the thing too. So uh, that's pretty good. Um, I also want to point out from my collection, I mean, I have a lot of uh, the the standard stuff you can see there, all of the King's Quest between the Roberta Williams uh, anthology and then uh, seven and eight behind it, uh, Quest for Glory anthology, which I think is just one through four uh, is up at the top there. Uh, big box copies, I have uh, Roger Wilco, uh, Space Quest six, I have Space Quest four, Passionate Patty is the Leisure Suit Larry three, and then uh, Police Quest three, The Kindred. Um, and, uh, you'll also see to the right bottom Jones in the fast lane, uh, which is a great game. Uh, Freddie Farkas, another wonderful game, alien legacy. Uh, I don't know why I put that in there other than it's a Sierra game. And actually this isn't even all of my Sierra games because there are ones like I have half life, but you know, eh. um, and then, uh, you'll see Larry, what is that? Six love for sale. And then leisure suit, Larry Magna cum laude. Um, and then on the left, I have Hoyle classic games on disc. Uh, I have another version of Hoyle on CD. I have shivers. And then right behind there, you'll see right under Roger Wilco, Willie Beamish. And, uh, that's interesting. I wasn't even aware I had that. I pulled it out when I was going through my CDs collection and, um, the, that is a CD based PC CD based copy of Willie Beamish. And those are to my knowledge, relatively rare. Um, you know, uh, so yeah, it's, uh, that was kind of interesting to me, but, uh, but yeah, I mean, you know, I say rare, I mean, none of these things are crazy valuable, but I mean, uh, I, this is again, a great part of my growing up. And, uh, so yeah, I, I was excited to go through some of this stuff and maybe, I don't know what the first game will be, uh, of these that I would actually play, other than obviously the stuff on Roberta Williams anthology, which the CD based ones just really mostly have a CD in them. Uh, maybe there's a something on the on the in the flap. But when I get to the big box games, I guess probably Larry three uh, is the first of those that I would get to. I might actually take some more pictures, open them up, put them uh, of the stuff that I have inside the box, because I don't I don't know that I have everything that comes inside the box, but I certainly have some of the stuff that comes inside the box. So, uh, yeah, I might do that. Um, but I hope you enjoy this episode. I did just want to clarify that I do own this game, not that it makes a whole heck of a lot of difference, hell of a lot of difference, whatever. But uh, yeah, so enjoy Mixed Up Mother Goose. Hello gamers, this is Dan H and welcome to Classic Gaming with Booze. This is Mixed Up Mother Goose. Mother Goose will eventually share, there you go. Uh, 
I am here. Uh, I had boy that music. Oh fuck. Okay, so I have uh, I have booze. I have a Old Forester 1910, uh, Old Fine Whiskey. Uh, because I don't know why. Okay, stop making me invent reasons for telling you. Because it sounded like Mother Goose, Old Forester. Sounded like it went together. Okay, so this I'm I'm kind of reaching back. This is a 1987 game. Uh, I'm going to talk in a second about why uh, I I'm reaching back to this. Um, but, uh, I, and, and this is going to be probably a really short game, really short video. There's not a lot to this. But uh, here's to the nights we'll never remember and the friends we'll never forget. Cheers. <sighs> okay, Old Forester's pretty good. Uh, can I, okay. Um, use the arrow keys to move. Uh, pointer, uh, to your name, and then press enter. Uh, uh I don't have a, a name. Um, okay. Can't open the file. Please enter your name. D and H. Um, choose the character you'd like. Uh, sure. Why not? Okay. Good night, D and H. <laughs> Uh, so this game does not have a text parser. Basically, you just go, uh, collecting items, and, oh, there you go. That's probably copyrighted. I'm sure, uh, that's gonna suck. But anyway, uh, you just go collecting items. You can only hold one item at a time, so fuck the whole inventory system. And, uh, you just get the- okay, there's- yeah. I'm dreaming, I guess? Anyway, and it's all fairy tales and shit, and, uh, you just, um... Uh, and, and it talks about the fairy tale once you get it. Um, so anyway, uh, I've never played this game. And, uh, I, I, I don't own this game. <laughs> I'm gonna level with you right now. Uh, so, here's the thing. Um, I, uh, when I decided I was gonna do this classic gaming series, I made a list of, uh, you know, a bunch of old adventure-style games and, and related games... Uh, from Sierra and LucasArts and Infocom and all these all these companies, and there were several hundred games on this list. Um, so then I went through and I highlighted the ones that I thought were uh, terribly relevant or important. Oh, DNH, my rhymes are mixed up. Okay, um, I could probably be hitting enter at this point. I guess I don't know. Please help me fix them. Uh, yeah, that's uh, what I'm here for. I guess. Um, okay, eighteen. Um, wow, can you, uh, oh, that's, uh, okay. <laughs> um, fast speed, is that good? Uh, that might be good. Can I go back to full screen mode? Okay. Uh, so anyway, <laughs> uh, okay, fast, uh, should be fine. So, um, You can't, uh, you just walk into places. There's Mother Goose. Okay. Um, so, uh, there's, uh, that's Mary. I'm, or, is that Mary? It's Mary, I think. Uh, fetch my watering can. Okay. Okay, that's fine. So, um, <clears throat> I, I've never played this game. Don't, don't own it. Um, and it doesn't get sold anywhere. Okay. Uh, there's... She's lost her sheep or some bullshit. I don't know. Um, there's a fucking dog. Uh, I don't want to get the dog yet, though. I think I can go over here. Um, there's, like, a bowl. There's, like, an old crotchety fucking man. Fetch my sixpence. I've never even heard it. Okay. Uh, okay, fine. I'll fetch your fucking sixpence. Uh, let me, let me be for a second. I think I need to go up here. Okay. There's the watering can. I'm pretty positive. Wasn't that what it looked like? That's not the watering can. Plus, I can't pick it up. Okay, um... I th thought... <laughs> for, okay, again, also, this is, uh... Am I able to, uh... Oh, for fucking... Fastest, is that... Okay, that, that probably is better. <laughs> Lots better. Okay. Um, uh, 
<clears throat> I can't even talk. I don't even know what the fuck I'm talking about. Here's... Um, and the fucking phone is ringing. Wow. Uh, okay, E4, Jack Horner in the pie. Okay, I, that's fine. Here, I, I got this now. I'm good. Jack Horner's in this... Nope. Uh, he's in... This is probably too fast, but he's in this place. I give him the pie. Okay. Great. <laughs> oh, I need more whiskey. Little Jack Horner sat in the corner eating of Christmas pie. He put in his thumb... Uh, and this song is playing. And pulled out a plum and said, What a good boy am I. I'm not going to sing this fucking thing for you. I'm telling you right now. Okay. So is that is that a point? Uh, that's a point. I guess there are 18 things that I need to get. Okay. Um, that was one. Now there's like a mouse. Fucking the mouse goes to... Uh, I don't fucking know. Um, blah, blah, blah. The mouse belongs to the clock on C4. Check. Right here. Hickory dickory dock. <laughs> the mouse ran up the clock. <laughs> oh, fudge. Uh, the clock struck one, and down he run. Hickory dickory dock. Is that how that fucking goes? That does not sound right at all. Okay, anyway. Um, then here's a, uh, a horse uh, that's on D3, so that was... Uh, I forget what I said. C4, so D is, is in the middle, and up one. Okay. Yep. Ride a cock horse to Bran Banbury Cross to see a fine lady upon a white horse. Ring on her fingers and bells on her toes. She shall have music wherever she goes. Wow. I don't even remotely know what to say about that. Um, wow. Okay, uh, so anyway, don't own this, so here, so there was a list of games, and then I went through, uh, I don't have anything to give to that guy, uh, Humpty Dumpty, um, I'm, I'm supposed to probably do something about that. Okay, sheep. Uh, okay, there, there was like Bo Peep over here. Um, we already saw. Um, so I had a list of games, and is it a no? That's not her. Um, was it down here? Yeah, there you go. I'm I'm good. I'm spectacular at this game. I'm already like fucking four out of eighteen. Shit. So um, I am never fucking going to remember um <laughs> what ones of this I've done either. That's I probably should have done this shit in some order or something. I don't know. Uh, little boat people lost their sheep, can't tell where to find them, leave them alone, they'll come home and bring their tails behind them. Okay. Um, some kind of dog. The dog goes to F4, so that's way the fuck over there, but that's fine. So, um, as I've tried to spit out, I highlighted the games on that 200 or 300 game list that I thought, okay, these are the ones that I'm definitely wanting to play, right? Um, and so, uh... There were a lot of stuff that was kind of not totally along the lines. Uh, like, there was... Uh, I talked about um, the Donald Duck's Playground. I talked about Mickey's Adventure. Um, there was some older, only text-based adventure games, like Zork, which I... You know, I, and I might play some of these things here or there. We'll see. Or uh, Soft Porn Adventures, which was the precursor to Larry. I might play some of these things here or there. Uh, where, where is my little dog gone? Where, where can he be? With his ears cut short and his tail cut long, oh, where or where can he be? Okay. Um... And so, uh, you know, I might, I don't, uh, can you help us find the castle? 
Uh, yeah, why not? Uh, D1 on the inside. Um, okay. Yeah, it's over here. Oh, he's happy with his dog. Good. I'm glad that I could help. Uh, oh, actually, uh, I need to come down here. Um, through here. And over here. And up here. There we go. Um, and so... There were certain... Okay. Child please being around me my pipe. Okay. Well, but I brought these people here. Were these the people... Did I get points for that? D oh, shit. Um, I guess not. What? Um, Fiddler's three belong to King Cole, and the last time needs to be brought to him to obtain the point inside. Oh, shit. Okay. Fine. The fiddle belongs to the cat on G1. Okay. 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 Um, uh, so, boy, I'm really struggling with this story. So, anyway, uh, there were a, a number of things, uh, yet yeah, your lamb has wandered off. Give me a fucking second, lady. I'll find the lamb. Trust me. Uh, okay. Um, here we go. And, uh, and so, oh, this has got to be good with the fiddle, cat and the fiddle, <laughs> fucking shit. Okay, um, so, but there were games that I had highlighted in that list that I thought, okay, these are the main ones that I'm going to play, right? I mean, these are primary loop adventure games. And up through King's Quest IV, which I, which you saw me play last week, uh, the last couple weeks, I've played all of the ones that I highlighted with the exception of Mixed Up Mother Goose. When I got to Mixed Up Mother Goose, which would have been, oh, a while ago, a little while ago, a few few weeks ago anyway, um, basically a little dog laughed to such a sport and the dish ran away with a spoon. Okay, fine. Yeah, great. Um, I saw some, like, meat or some shit just sitting in the middle of the ground. I'm sure that's sanitary. C2? Okay. Um, and, uh... It's like a uh, it's like a house is the C two thing. It's this thing right here. Um, <clears throat> and so basically, I could oh I picked up sixpence somewhere. Okay, that was that old guy. Good. Uh, it must have been in here. I didn't even notice it. Uh, and I couldn't. I must have just picked it up because I can only carry one fucking thing at a time. <laughs> I returned your sixpence, dipshit. Better be, uh, fucking stoked for that. In your weird-ass crooked house. There was a crooked man! He went... A crooked smile. Uh, found a crooked sixpence and a crooked... Oh, uh, it's all crooked. Bought a crooked cat. Caught a crooked mouse. I... Together in a... Uh, that's fucking weird as shit. Wow. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> uh, okay. Can I go in your little crooked house? Is there is there shit in here? Is this candle something I can take? This candle is something I can take. Good. Candlestick. Uh, E5. Excellent. Uh, maybe one of these days I'll get out. There we go. Um, yeah, you're looking for something, lady. I'll 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 get there. And you're looking for your watering can. Uh, I can only do so much. I'm only one man. People need to solve their own fucking problems. Okay, that, that you're going to jump over the candlestick? Okay. So, um, my problem was I don't own this game. Never have. Never played it. Couldn't buy it. It's not on GOG. Most of the games I've played were on GOG.com, good old games, or Steam. Uh, uh, Gold Rush I got on Steam. Uh, also, um... I mentioned I got uh, um, the Black Cauldron from Allo.com, and he has uh, um, Jack Be Nimble, Jack Be Quick, jump, jump over the candlestick. He burned his ass. <laughs> okay. Uh, and he has, he has, the goose is nothing, right? I, I, I can't get the goose. He's fucking honking at me, though. Okay. Um, and uh, oh, there's a watering can. Awesome. Um, okay, good. Uh, and so. Uh, <sighs> Uh, here you go, lady. Water your, uh, your garden. <clears throat> Mary, Mary, quite contrary. Uh, how does your garden grow? Um, 
with silver bells, that's weird, uh, and cockle shells, uh, and pretty maids all in a row. That's fucking awesome. Okay, this game is remade a lot too. So anyway, couldn't buy it. So what are your options at that point, right? You can't buy it. What are the options? Well, shit. Um, you know, there's like a dozen websites that, uh, that have uh, abandoned software or archive software, uh, which, you know, we could argue about the legality of that um which uh is probably not legal they probably don't have those rights although they are saying it's abandoned and i guess if they haven't been sued yet or something they're probably at least somewhat correct although you know whatever we could argue but about the legality of me downloading those though and playing them uh which isn't technically illegal i mean um oh yeah these guys but they're they're third uh the second item is a pie for D1. What's the first item? Uh, the pipe. Did I have the pipe yet? Uh, he, wanted, he wanted me to find his pipe. Uh, she wants the lamb. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I can only find so much, lady. I'll, I'll, I'll work on it. Um, uh, okay, there's a knife. Uh, where does the knife go? Uh, knife goes to C1. Okay. We're good. Can't go up. Oh, there's the pipe. Well, I'm all right. I'm I'm working on the knife here. I think it goes over here. There we go. Um, <laughs> you know, it, it, we can argue about the legality. Was he going to stab these fucking kids? Man, nursery rhymes were fucking brutal, is what I gotta say. Little Tommy Tucker sings for his supper. Hmm. <sighs> what shall he eat? White bread and butter. How shall he cut it without ever a knife? How how will he be married without ever a wife? Uh, well, that second one is technically true. I guess. Well, he could have a husband, I suppose. I don't, uh, I, I, okay. Anyway, uh, 10 of 18. I'm, I'm really just beat. I'm okay. I don't even know anymore. These are fucking weird. So we could argue, I, I'm not going to have a huge discussion about the legality right now. So there are a number of those sites. I'm sure that, you know, nine out of 10 of them are perfectly fine. And then one of them is like riddled with, uh, um, with, uh, viruses and shit. Um, and I could try scanning it, and I could try looking for ones where, uh, uh, okay, bring me my bowl. I don't know where your bowl is, so you're just gonna have to fucking wait. Um, and, uh, you know, I could try scanning it and looking for ones with really old files and stuff and whatever. So the other option was there are some websites that basically say, hey, play this game within the browser. And, uh, I'm not necessarily saying that that's any more legal, quote unquote, so whatever. Um, and I'm not completely even saying it's any, uh, my wife's gone again. Uh, Peter Pumpkin Eater belongs with the wife. Okay, find, find your wife. Uh, can I go in here? Do you have anything in here for me to steal and give to somebody? Because they own it and you people are not solving your own fucking problems. Okay, um, I don't know. Uh, I, I, uh, I'm still looking for shit. Okay, there was the crooked house. Uh, these people need to pale. Uh, okay. Um, nothing on that screen. And then there's that. Is this nothing? Because this seems like it should be something. But I can't pick it up. And it's not a picture that I see on the list, so I guess it's not anything. I don't know. Okay, here, what is this shit? This is uh, a fucking tree. Uh, Lady Ole, who lives in the shoe? Um, G3, fuck. Okay. Um, uh, so anyway, found a website, plays the game in the browser. Okay, fair enough. Uh, yeah, it's fine, guys. You're third. I can't take you yet. Um, and so I thought I'd give it a try. So look, here's the thing about this game, right? Um, 
This is a very short game, so I figured I'd try recording it, and if, uh, and I probably should try, um, saving the game, although it seems to, like, fucking glitch out and not go full screen when I'm saving it, and so you can't die in this particular game, so I figured this is a good one to try in the web browser, see if it even records, see if it gets the audio, see how it works. I don't even know how this is going to work. You might not even see this episode. I might be drinking this Old Forester 1910 for nothing, uh, which, you know, is not for nothing here. Cheers. Mm. There was an old woman who lived in a shoe. She had so many children, she didn't know what to do. She gave them some broth without any bread. She whipped them all soundly and put them to bed. That, that was what was going on on the screen when I was talking to you about fucking... Okay, anyway. Hmm. <sighs> so, um, okay. Um, so this is probably a good game to test. I'm seeing that um, trying to do anything with the escape menu. What if I just hit F5? Press enter to save or any other key to exit. Hmm. See, but and it also doesn't have the normal save system either where you're naming stuff. So I don't know that the web-based thing is going to work for more complicated games. So point being, I had just skipped this one initially. I was like, okay, uh, I can't play it. That's fine. No big deal. Never played it. Uh, ladder, this goes to Humpty Dumpty. Um, so I wasn't going to care. But here's the thing. The next uh game on the list that i had uh not the next game actually the next game i'm probably going to play is probably going to be leisure suit larry uh 2 but one of the games that's right around this period of time and it's actually dating back to an agi game although it doesn't have quite the same parser based stuff uh is manhunter humpty dumpty sat on a wall humpty dumpty had a great fall all the king's horses and all the king's men why is that guy on a fucking wheeled horse what in the fuck Okay, I'm okay. I'm okay. Anyway, uh, so one of the... <laughs> that's pretty fucking brutal, too. He's cracked it. Okay, anyway. Um, so 12 out of 18. So the next... One of the next games is Manhunter, uh, New York. Manhunter 1. And um, I really do want to play uh, Manhunter, New York. Um, that is something that, uh, so I didn't, uh, I never owned that game. My friend owned that game and I played it over at his house. He was a really big fan of the game. I was, eh, it's okay. I'm uh, not really my style, uh, but, but I enjoyed it. Um, so, okay. You're fucking honking and shit. Um, and you're walking around. Uh, I'm looking for things. Okay, here we go. Um, uh, the, oh, the F2. Okay, the lamb. Yeah, fuck. Okay, all right. Let's, let's go. Uh, yeah. I'll take you all the way up over there, because, you know, that's fine. No problem. Um, so, Manhunter is really one that I definitely wanted to play, and it highlighted, and so I was like, yeah, I kind of don't want to avoid that one necessarily. So, um, I don't know. I need to find a way to maybe play these games. Uh, we'll see. I, I, I don't know what yet I'm going to do about Manhunter, because, again, I can't find it for sale. Another one that comes to the top of my head is the Hoyle games, which aren't really adventure games, but uh, they're kind of cool. The earlier ones, you're playing, like, cribbage or chess against uh, um, one of the classic Sierra characters. So, um, yeah, you know, uh, it followed her to school one day, which was against the rule. It made all the children laugh and play, to see a lamb at school. Um, okay, well, we don't want children laughing and playing. That's fucking bullshit. Okay, um... Uh, hey, the flag is like a Sierra flag. I already took the thing out of here. Is that like the Sierra emblem? Ah, okay. Um, yeah, nothing. Oh, Humpty's fixed, I guess. Good for, good for you. Um, okay. Just gonna, just gonna comb these, uh screens for more stuff this side put there okay um let me find my tuffet yeah her tuffet oh i'm supposed to take her to the tuffet okay yeah i got it that's fine yeah your tuffet's over here lady that that's why i couldn't pick up the tuffet that's fine. 
Uh, was it over here? This is why I don't look. Where is it? B2. B2. Uh, right here. This is uh, one more up. Okay, it is. All right. Uh, 14 of 18. I'm getting pretty close. This is, again, I said this is going to be a short episode. Little Miss Muffet sat on her tuffet. Um, eating of curds and whey. It was, I thought it was her curds and whey. Uh, there came a, along came a spider. I thought, because there was like a fucking movie along came a spider, right? I sat down beside her and frightened Miss I just fucking brought you here. Oh my god. Okay, well, that was fucking worthless. Alright, well, it gave me a point, right? So, uh, yay me. Okay. <laughs> Did she drop this? Uh, is this something I need? No, she just dropped it for, for shit. Um, okay. Uh, they need a, a bucket. Um,. Oh, she's she's back on her tough it. Um Okay. <laughs> so yeah, I'll have to figure out what I'm gonna do about um and, and anything else over here? No. Uh, uh oh, okay, I'm down in here. Anything in here? I I took something off of that. Mouse is still up there. Good. Kudos. Um, so, yeah, I'll have to figure out what I'm going to do. Um, oh, yeah, there was the bucket in here. Shit. Okay. See, the walkthrough says where the things go, but it doesn't really say where to find them. Uh, sometimes I should do better about looking for a walkthrough. Anyway, <clears throat> I mean, I'm, I'm 14 of 18, now 15 of 18. Jack and Jill went up the hill to fetch a pail of water. And they fall the fuck down. Um, Jack fell down, broke his crown. I guess they're saying skull. And Jill came tumbling after. Oh, that's classy. Why the the sun is all smiling and shit? Oh, I like that uh, sound effect. That's good. Um, okay. 15 of 18. And then actually two of the... Th what am I missing here? Cause, so I need the pie... And then the fiddlers for Cole. Oh, and then uh, Peter Pumpkin's wife. Where the fuck am I supposed to find his wife, though? I haven't seen a woman. Giggity. Um, this, uh... Yeah, we're hungry. I already brought you fucking food. Yeah, it's right there. Son of a bitch. Okay. Um. All right. Guy's got his knife still. Um. This dude's like, bring me my fucking pie. Uh, yeah, your bowl. I guess this is not a pie. I don't know. Whatever. It's a fucking bowl. Yeah, I got it, dude. I, I'm I'm looking for your stuff. Trust me. It's my highest priority in life <laughs> to solve everybody else's problems. Um, okay. Yeah, your wife. I, yeah, I got it. It's fine. Um, I can't get to that other thing back there. Hmm. The dog and the cat and the cow and the fucking moon. All right, it's dark right there. Is it getting to be nighttime? Am I losing? Was I supposed to go in here? Oh, hey, here's your, here's the guy's fucking bull. Okay. Well. Um, yeah, I got it. Uh, <clears throat> so there we go.
So, bring me my Fiddlers 3. Yeah, why not? Um, 15 of 18. Uh, did I not? Oh, maybe I... 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So there's actually 20 things that you have to return, but I guess you only get one point for bringing that dude to all three. So I'm missing, I'm, I'm missing three things. Um, what are the other two? Maybe not. I, I don't, I think I've maybe returned all the other things. Well, other than the wife, I'm missing the wife. I don't know where the fuck she is. So <clears throat> these guys, <clears throat> these guys though, come on. Yeah, I, I know where you're going. I took you back. The, you fucking bitches. I took you back there once, but the dude was like, eh, fuck, I don't want him yet because they haven't had my bowl in my pipe. Bastard. Um, I hope he doesn't have to be like the very, very last thing. I hope he isn't going to go, oh, hey, well, I don't want these fuckers yet because you haven't returned all of your shit. So, no, it's OK. It's good. Uh, King Cole was a merry old soul, and a merry old soul was he, with a corn cob pipe and a bowl of piss. He called for his pipe, and he called for his bowl, and he called for his fiddlers three. Okay, good. Uh, yeah, it looks like I've gotten everything else except the wife. And I'm a little hesitant to even exit out of... Okay, so I have 16 of 18. Uh, I just... But I have to think this is going to get me three points. I'm a little hesitant, though, to um, exit out to look up where the wife might be because... Um, because uh, I don't want it to... What's the... Is that person up there? No? Hello, D and H? Yeah. Hi. Tell me where the wife is, fucker. Okay. Well, anyway. Um, yeah, I'm a little hesitant. Is, you're not the wife. You're the... You got your watering can. Oh, yeah. Oh, I live in a pumpkin. Well, fucking shit. See, okay, that was my bad. That one was literally my bad. I'm sorry. That That's my fault. I, you know, I should walk close to people. I was avoiding them because I didn't want them to tell me their fucking problems. And legitimately, like, that's the woman I was, I, I saw her like 15 fucking times. Okay, my bad. Here we go. That's all right. Like I said, this is quick. And boom. Peer, peer, pumpkin eater. Uh, had a wife and couldn't keep her. Put her in a pumpkin shell, uh, and there he kept her very well. I don't know what a pumpkin shell is. A hollowed out pumpkin? I, okay. 17 of 18. Well, shit. Okay. Watering can? Check. Candlestick? Check. Dog? Check. Uh, pie to little Jack Horner? Check. Mouse? Uh, sheep? Broth to the Lady Bull, Sixpence, Toy Horse, um, Lambs to Marry, Wife, uh, Meat, Miss Tuffet, The Bucket, The Knife, The Fiddle, The um, Ladder. I, I legit don't know what I'm missing here. Uh, can I... One hundred percent legit. Don't know what I'm missing. I have seventeen of eighteen. Maybe I'm supposed to just go in here and say, "Hey, I solved shit." Hello, D and H. Mm hmm. Yeah, I I solved all your shit, lady. I think. Obviously, I haven't. Cab do anything? Nope. Sure doesn't. Can I get back on the goose and fly away? Nope. Hey, goose. 
Oh. Are you fucking kidding me with that? Are you fucking kidding me with that? Well, uh, yeah, I don't even, I'm really pissed off about that. Sorry. <laughs> Jack Spratt could eat no fat. His wife could eat no lean. And so between them both, they looked the platter clean. You know, I should have known because they kind of acted like they needed the fucking steak. And I was like, oh, it's right fucking there and whatever, whatever. But all right. So I got it. 18 of 18. Yeah, I'm, I'm awesome. Uh, oh, now Mother Goose is coming on the fucking goose. To tell me I rocked her face off. Yay me! <laughs> Thank you very much. Great job, DNH. And I fly back away on a goose. Mother goose. <laughs> oh no, I'm flying. I'm not, I, you know, that's fine. And the king and the people. Am I going to marry the goose? This is like the wedding from King's Quest. We all thank you, DNH. Hip hip. Hooray. <laughs> oh, I am the man. Rocking faces since 1910. 1987? That when this game was? Incidentally, if you've ever had your face rocked, you should probably see a doctor. Mm. <sighs> okay. So, this did not work spectacularly. <laughs> I'm not going to lie to you. Uh, and the save thing, I mean, it let me save, but I'd be worried about it uh, if I really had to rely on it. Um, I don't know what I'm going to do about the Manhunter stuff, because I do want to play Manhunter now. It's not probably going to be the next thing. I'm very sure the next thing you're going to see from me is going to be Leisure Suit Larry 2. Um, in fact, I've already, uh, loaded it up. Uh, also, Zach McCracken is, is right on the cusp. That would probably be right after Leisure Suit Larry. Uh, I'm pretty positive I'm going to do Larry first, though. And, um... Uh, Mother Goose and her design team hope you enjoyed Mixed Up Mother Goose. Congratulations on a job well done. Yeah, I'm fucking awesome. Okay. So, um, yeah, uh, so that's, that's probably what you're going to see. I don't entirely know um, what I'm going to do about the Manhunter stuff, but I'm going to find some way to play Manhunter. Uh, you know, we'll see. Um, but yeah, well, well done. Okay. Do I? Okay, good. I'm in bed still. There was a bird. I think that was a tweeting bird, that really annoying noise that happened. But I don't, I, I can't do anything else. Okay. Well. Uh, okay, fair enough. So that that actually, and like I said, never played that before. It, it wasn't too bad. It was very simplistic, no parser stuff. Uh, you know, um, I was really being a bonehead about uh the guy's wife and the little uh steak thing it was a pretty easy game honestly like you know introduction to uh sierra adventure games i guess but um not not too bad there are updated versions of mixed up mother goose i might try uh, but again you can't buy those either so i don't know what the fuck i'm gonna do i don't know what the fuck i'm gonna do anyway uh what i'm gonna do is i am gonna go but as always gamers have a good evening day and night. Minecraft, time lapse, mob traps, world maps, cat naps, rap tracks, perhaps. You'll tune in and watch the hijinks, and if you like, click the up and subscribe links.